when I in awesome wonder consider all the works thy hands had made. I see the stars, I hear the roar and thunder. Thy path throughout the universe displayed. Then sing my soul, my Savior God to thee. How great thou How great thou art, then sings my soul, my Savior God to thee. How great thou art, how great thou art. All the glory we give you all the honor we give you adoration we bless you because there is no god like you you are good you are kind your mercies and yours forever thank you thank you jesus for another day thank you for your mercy thank you for your goodness thank you for your love may your name be glorified in the name of jesus in jesus mighty name we have given thanks so today we'll be praying for parents parents guardians carers we pray for them that the spirit of excellence rest upon us in Jesus mighty name so we look at the scripture Ephesians chapter 6 Ephesians chapter 6 verse 1 to 4 children obey your parents in the Lord for this is right honor thy father and thy mother which is the first commandment with promise that it may be well with thee and thou mayest live long on the earth and ye fathers, provoke not your children to wrath, but bring them up in the nurture and admonition of the Lord. The Lord expects so much of parents that the first person, the first set of people, the, the child learns to respect, trust, trust first and foremost, even before respect, trust. So parents, the Lord expects a lot from us. So in this season of the spirit of excellence, let us appreciate the name of the Lord for making us parents, for the children he has given unto us, for the grace, for the strength. It's not easy to be a parent. At times you shout, you want to shout out your lungs. At times that you just get overwhelmed with so many responsibilities, yet you keep pressing, keep pushing. Father, thank you for making me a parent. Thank you for the strength. Thank you for grace upon my life. Thank you for your mercy. Thank you for your goodness. Blessed be your holy name. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name, we have given thanks. Amen. Let's pray into our lives this season that in the name of Jesus, every of our needs are met. Every of our needs is met. Every need is met. Every need is met in the name of Jesus. Every need we have this season is met in the name of Jesus. We shall not lack anything good. The school fees, the feeding fee, the money, everything we need to take care of these children, the Lord has released unto us in the name of Jesus. We lack nothing good in the name of Jesus. We lack nothing good in the name of Jesus. We lack nothing good in the name of Jesus. The blessing of the Lord is mighty upon us in the name of Jesus. Because we are parents in we are parents and we are parents indeed, we shall not lack any good thing in Jesus' mighty name. In Jesus' mighty name we have prayed. Amen. Let's pray for the spirit of patience. Not easy to be a parent. There are times we can just shout for no reason or get angry for no reason. The child is even confused, does not even understand why we are shouting. Or a lot of frustration. You see, there are many things that you're just thinking of, and the child comes to say, Mommy, I want to say, Go, 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 go
many transfer of aggressions and may the Lord help us in Jesus name. We need a spirit of patience. We need to be patient in raising the children that the Lord has given unto us. If you look at James chapter 1 verse 19. He says, Wherefore, my beloved brethren, let every man be swift to hear, slow to speak, and slow to walk. This scripture is very, very important in, in our parenting journey. He said we should be swift to hear, slow to speak, and slow to walk. There are many parents who are slow to hear, swift to speak, and swift to walk. That is not what the Lord wants. The Lord wants us to be swift to hear, slow to speak, and slow to walk. We pray, Father, the grace to be swift to hear, slow to speak, and slow to walk. Father, you listen to me in the name of Jesus. I need patience. But I give me the spirit of patience. I want to be patient with my children. I want to be patient. I want to raise them up in your fear. I want to raise them up in, in, in your way. But I give me the grace to be slow to speak, slow to anger, slow to wrath, and swift to hear. But I believe unto me that spirit in the name of Jesus. The spirit to be swift to hear, to be swift to hear. And I give unto me in the name of Jesus. I rebuke the spirit of impatience in the name of Jesus. Every spirit of anger, every spirit of anger, I come against you in the mighty name of Jesus. The spirit of patience rest upon me. The spirit of patience rest upon my family. The spirit of patience rest upon my home. In Jesus' mighty name we have prayed. Amen. We will pray for wisdom and discernment. Wisdom and discernment. James chapter 1 verse 5 says, If any of you lack wisdom, let him ask of God that giveth to all men liberally and upbraideth not, and it shall be given to him. James 1 5. I'll read it again. If any of you lack wisdom, let him ask of God that giveth to all men liberally and upbraideth not, and it shall be given him. We need wisdom. We need wisdom. We need to be discerning as well. Because there are many things we might not we might not hear from the children. So we have to discern. We need wisdom. Father, give unto us wisdom in the name of Jesus. Wisdom we need to raise these children, to raise them up in your fear. And I release unto us in the mighty name of Jesus. Please give us wisdom. Give us the spirit of wisdom and discernment in the name of Jesus. Help us to be discerning. Help us to be discerning. Help us to be discerning. In Jesus' mighty name we have prayed. Amen. We need trust and faith. We need to have faith in God. We need to have faith in God. We need to have faith in God. The Bible in Proverbs chapter 3, verse 5 to 6, it says, Trust in the Lord with all your heart and lean not on your own understanding. In all your ways acknowledge him and he shall direct your path. We need to trust in God with all our hearts, even in our fear, in our weaknesses, in our frustration. We need to trust in God. Father Lord, help us, O oh God, in the mighty name of Jesus. Help us trust you and you alone. Father, help me trust in you. Help me trust in you. Everything I have, everything in me, in the mighty name of Jesus. Help me trust in you. 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 In the name of Jesus. Lord, I believe. Help me. Help my unbelief. Help my unbelief. In any way I have any form of doubt. Father, help me in the name of Jesus. Help me help my faith to grow in you. In the mighty name of Jesus. Help me trust only in you. Concerning the life of the children you've given unto me. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name we have prayed. Amen. We need peace. We need peace. Oh, we need peace. John chapter 14, verse 27. John chapter 14, verse 27. It says, Peace I leave with you, my peace I give unto you. Not as the world giveth, give I unto you. Let not your heart be troubled, neither let it be afraid. We need peace. As parents, we need peace. Father Lord, give us peace in the name of Jesus. You say your peace you have given unto us. Not as the world giveth, but you give unto us peace. Father Lord, we receive that peace in the name of Jesus. We receive the peace in the name of Jesus. Peace that passes all understanding. We receive it in the name of Jesus. We receive it in the name of Jesus. We receive it in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Asian of this. Jesus' mighty name we have prayed. Let's pray for protection and preservation. Father, keep us, O Lord. Protect us from harm. 
Oh, Father, God, oh, so curry, but I got a bad, but I can't tell you, oh, so poor, oh, busy, but I don't love her. Protect us from harm in the name of Jesus. Protect us from harm in the name of Jesus. Protect us from harm in the name of Jesus. Protect us from harm in the name of Jesus. Protect us from harm in the name of Jesus. Protect us from harm in the name of Jesus. But I keep us, oh, Lord. Protect and preserve us, Lord, in the mighty name of Jesus. We solely depend on you. We depend on you. We depend on you. You have helped us in the past. You will help us again. You have helped us in the past. You will help us again. Oh, Jesus, we depend on you. Oh, Jesus, we depend on you. You are not a man that you would lie. When you speak a word, it comes to pass. Oh, Jesus, we depend on you. Oh, Jesus, we depend on you. But I will depend on you. Let your mercy speak for us in the name of Jesus. All the days of our life, let your mercy speak for us. Let your mercy speak for us in the morning. Let your mercy speak for us in the afternoon. Let your mercy speak for us at night. In the mighty name of Jesus, let your mercy speak for us. Let your mercy speak for us. Let your mercy speak for us. In Jesus' mighty name, we have prayed. Amen. So shall it be in the name of God the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Ghost. Amen. Thank you for joining today's session. God bless you. See you tomorrow.